you see? Behind this course. Yeah. 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 I think I've actually had a call about this area before. Yeah, There's a lady that calls me. Regularly, so can you see me? Yeah, I see him there. Uh, no, you don't have to chase him. That's fine. I'm not going to be able to get him with a hook stick. Just hold that yeah. for me if you can. I'll grab it from you now. Same snake, he just keeps coming back here. Somebody caught him before, nice but they one. let him go down there. And hey guys, Willem from Blauberg Snake Rescue here. I just retrieved this Cape Cobra from, from a farm in Kuntemans Kloof. He was stuck behind, uh, well, he was stuck between a shed door and the wall. It was quite tricky to get out actually. He was, he was very deep in there, and there were a couple, a couple of hiding spaces for him to go to, and I couldn't reach him with my hook stick. So, what I did is I managed to just get hold of him with my tongs and brought him closer and then unfortunately I did have to neck him just to get him out safely. Please don't ever do that. You may see the guys on TV doing that with snakes and you may see me and other snake catchers doing those that in our videos or our photos every now and then but remember that we've had the training on how to do that safely. You don't ever want to pick up a snake like that yourself. Um, some snakes can't even be necked safely. Uh, with some snakes no matter how you hold them they can still get to you. So this is a Cape Cobra. You can see he's a beautiful brown one with uh, with yellow flecks and he's actually got a reddish belly as well which we may be able to see just now. Cape Cobras are dangerous. They're, they're venomous and they have a neurotoxic venom which means it affects your nervous system. If one of these snakes bites you and you become paralyzed and part of that is that you stop breathing and that's where the danger lies. So if you or anyone you know ever does get bitten by a snake like this you have to get to a hospital as quickly as you can. There's nothing you can do at home to help. Just get to the nearest hospital with a trauma so, unit. You can see he's nice and feisty now that all the newspaper is out. He doesn't have a hiding spot anymore. So I'm just going to release him in the bushes over here. Let's get him out of the bin first. Come on. There we go. So let's get him out. <coughs> we'll put him here. And you can go and find a nice spot to hide. And you'll see, like all snakes, even though this is a dangerous snake, he doesn't want anything to do with me. See how he's trying to get away? The moment I give him a spot to escape to, he's going to be on his way. There we go. Thanks, guys. Stay safe.